So I'm here in Intervention World, and I want to give out some special thanks right now. I see that we're now up to about 38 reviews here on Amazon. Excellent. All of you are going to be entered into the raffle tomorrow. And uh, I just want to say something. I want to say thanks to Mr. Tapwater. He says there's an improvised comedic powerhouse, despite the heavy context around addiction and intervention, still finds a way to crack me up. Uh, Nancy Pollock, well thought out, excellent content that relates to many families, funny and heartwarming yet serious in nature. Lisa Madden, this movie was wacky and funny, I laughed and felt like I was stuck in the intervention room with these characters. Underneath all the zanius was a thoughtful consideration of life that stuck with me. Uh, I love that. Uh, the pro-choice line cracked her up. Also stuck with her also, that's interesting. Uh, Emily Carr, this movie is hilarious. It's the office level awkwardness meets It's Always Sunny. I love that take. Carol Fol Fulkerson, this quirky indie film was warm and engaging while also being a comedic success. Thad, uh, independent film, there are some strong performances. He Shout out to Phil, that's great. And I know we're not gonna get perfect scores every time. Like Brandon here, he says uh, he had a hard time with the shaky cam. Definitely worth a watch, though. Thank you. Appreciate that. Lyle McCaw had a really nice time watching it. Uh, shout out to Jeremy Eden for that one as a great performer amongst the rest. Thomas Wolf, Ryan O'Hara is a natural in front of the camera, steals the comedic show with his character, Fire Tank Frank. Quinn watched this movie twice, cracked her up. That's great. Steph, uh, Steven Ruggiero, fully improvised movie set in the Burbs, Chicago. Gotta see it. First thing that came to mind was the movie Drinking Buddies, Joe Swanberg, love it. Zachary Wagner, this movie extremely funny but also well grounded in some heavier subject matter. An Amazon, Amazon customer says great movie from an independent. Heather H, entertaining and funny, lots of wit and a great job by cast members. Brian, mock doc that's funny and captivating. Nate Wagner, what a great way to start the year. Oh, thank you, Nate. Victoria, Dysfunction at its finest. Del Harvey, what a surprising indie comedy, well written and acted. Mike Cuso, phenomenally funny, five stars. Thank you, buddy. Uh, Tom Zarnowski, solid editing, solid cast, great. Uh, Amazon customer, great movie, five stars. Another Amazon customer gave it five. Another Amazon customer, love the one-liners, want to get down on some funeral kicks while getting high on Elmer's glue. Cody Ohlendorf, great indie film. Lisa Lennon, perfectly awkward. This movie had me laughing all the way through. Liz Stewart compares me to, look out Quentin Tarantino, uh-oh. <laughs> uh, we got Lloyd C, this was a very funny film. TJ Green, wow, I'm not sure what I was expecting, but it was such a great watch, thank you. Kevin Ullman, this movie was hilarious. Would definitely recommend for the whole family, that's great. Uh, Rick Schuler, well thought out characters, laugh out loud moments. Mr. Guest, if you're reading this, I don't actually wish you any ill will because he said eat your heart out. DNI Simmons, intervention is a really funny expansion of the Christopher Guest style mockumentary. He says it's about vanity in its own way, which is interesting. Michael Hasipin, Mike uh, has says if you like The Office, you like this. Rose loved it, laughed out loud throughout. All characters had a unique personality. To all of you out there, even if you haven't reviewed yet and you just watched it and you enjoyed it, uh, I don't know why you haven't gotten around to that, but to all of you who have seen the movie, given support for the movie, thank you so, 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 so much. Thank you. I hope you have a great weekend, and uh, you can always watch our movie on Amazon Prime in the raffles tomorrow. We will see you then.